Delaware is a great place to live, but it's not all sunshine and rainbows. In this video, I'm gonna give you the good, the bad, and the ugly of living in Delaware. Hello everyone, I'm Jen, your Delaware Realtor. You may be wondering if Delaware is a great place to live or not. And in this video, I'm going to give you my honest opinion of what it's like living here. Spoiler alert, it's not all perfect, but there are some really good things about it. Let's start off with the good. Delaware is a great place to live if you are looking for a quiet suburban lifestyle. With its small towns and rural areas, Delaware offers a relaxed lifestyle, which is perfect for raising a family or if you are someone that is trying to escape that hustle and bustle of city life. And with its close proximity to places like Philadelphia, Baltimore, and New York City, it's perfect for someone who wants to be close to the action, but still wants access to the suburban amenities. With that being said, Delaware is not without a vibrant city life. Wilmington, which is Delaware's largest city and the state's cultural center, is home to the Wilmington Riverfront which has museums, art galleries, theaters, and has many events and festivals going on throughout the year. Wilmington is also known for its excellent restaurants, which offers a variety of cuisines from all around the world. In addition to its urban offerings, Wilmington has many parks and recreations, making it an ideal place for someone who enjoys the outdoors. So whether you're looking for a robust cultural center or a more relaxed suburban lifestyle, Delaware has something to offer. It is also a great place to raise a family. With its mild climate, Delaware is a great place to enjoy all of the outdoor activities year round with our beaches and state parks. But one of the number one things that I love about Delaware is this close knit community feel. In such a small state, it is so easy to get to know your neighbor. And there's a real sense of pride of being a Delawarean. And like I said before, with it being centrally located, it's super easy to take weekend trips to Philadelphia, Baltimore, and even New York. Overall, the state offers such a great lifestyle. Delaware may be the second smallest state in the country, but it has a lot to offer retirees. For one, Delaware has some of the lowest taxes in the nation, and this is great for retirement because most of the time your income is fixed. When polled, 35% of people said that they were moving to Delaware for retirement. And there are so many great 55 and older communities that are low maintenance throughout the state. So whether you're moving to Delaware for retirement or just looking to raise a family, Delaware has so much to offer. Listen, can I be honest with you? If you would have told me growing up that I would be living in Delaware and actually enjoy living here, I would have told you that you were absolutely insane. But truly, I love living here. I can't imagine not living in the country and not having chickens, not having the peace of quiet that I have here without fire trucks and police officers driving past my house all hours of the night. Growing up when I would visit my grandparents who lived in Delaware, I would always complain how there was nothing to do. But what I come to realize is that even when I had so-called things to do, I rarely did them. Most of the time I stayed in and just watched a movie. But now living in Delaware, I'm more active than I was in my home state and that's because of the property that I own. So now I'm able to enjoy the outdoors and tend to my chickens or my garden or hang out on the patio and I'm still close to amenities like grocery stores, hospitals, entertainment. So I absolutely love living here mostly because I'm more active than I was actually living in my home state. Okay, so now let's talk about the bad because when there's good, there's also bad. Delaware may be small, but it packs a big punch of boredom. If you are not into the suburban lifestyle or like me and like to hang out at home with your chickens, Delaware may not be the place for you because outside of Wilmington, there are not many big city amenities and the nightlife is pretty much dead unless it's the summer and you're in Dewey. Delaware can be a tough place to find a job, especially without a college degree. Other than the high paying jobs centered around the city of Wilmington, it is sometimes very difficult to find a job with career growth opportunities. 
Now, there are job opportunities in the healthcare field throughout the state, but many of the jobs are centered around the hospitality industry. Also, keep in mind if you're thinking about moving here that Delaware is at risk for hurricanes and flooding. Although we don't get hit with hurricanes every year, there is that rare occurrence like for example Hurricane Sandy that did have significant damage to our coastal areas. So unless you're looking for a dull, uneventful, flooded life, you might want to give Delaware a pass. With all of that being said, Delaware has come a long way more recently, and if you've been following my channel or following me on Instagram, I have been sharing more things to do in Delaware and some hidden gems. So if you are not subscribed, be sure to subscribe or follow me on Instagram so that you do not miss a thing. Okay, so now let's get down to the ugly. If you're thinking about moving to Delaware, there are some things that you should know. One, the traffic is terrible. Two, the population density is high, so expect to be living on top of your neighbor unless you live in the rural areas of Kent County. And three, housing is expensive. In the past 10 years, we have seen a significant increase in Delaware's population, especially in and around the beaches and the Middletown area. With the increase in population, we have not seen an increase in the infrastructure, which has caused severe congestion and traffic in those areas. The increased demand has caused a significant rise in home values and home prices. This, coupled with the fact that it's difficult to find a job, can affect Delaware's affordability. But going back to the good, Delaware's low taxes help to compensate for this. So, why would anyone want to live in Delaware? Well, as I've said before, the central location on the East Coast is very appealing to new residents. Plus, Delaware is home to some of the best beaches and coastal living. But I would say the number one reason why most people want to live in Delaware are because of the low taxes. So, if you can put up with the traffic, Delaware may just be the place for you. If you are thinking about moving to Delaware, I would love the opportunity to work with you. There is a link down below in the description for a one-on-one -on -one buyer consultation where we can discuss what you're looking for. And if you are a Delaware homeowner and you are thinking about selling your home, I would also love the opportunity to work with you. There's a link down below in the description to get an instant valuation of what your home is worth. I really hope that this video helps. If it did, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any Delaware content. And I will see you on the next video. Hey, are you thinking about moving to Delaware and you're curious about Delaware's market? Check out this video right here. And if you would love to tour Delaware New Construction Homes with me, check out this playlist right here. And don't forget, subscribe to my channel.